Hi everyone, Vegas Film Critic here, Jeffrey Coward, here to review the thriller horror film Crawl, starring Kayla Scaladario, uh, Barry Pepper, and directed by Alexander Aja. Uh, this is what I call the ultimate summer popcorn movie. I mean, you've got to set up the movie, we have uh, a, a girl named Haley who's a, a college swimmer. She's on the college swim team, and they're in the middle of a Category 5 hurricane in southern Florida where they live, and her family can't get a hold of her father. So she drives through uh, all the roadblocks, all the police block, police brigades saying, look, this is too dangerous. She's like, i got to find out why my father's not answering his phone. So she gets to their old family house, and now it's just like, I mean, rain everywhere. It's just crazy. This movie doesn't waste any time getting going. She gets in there, and she gets in, finds her father in the basement who's unconscious, who's got this wound on him, and this 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 basement is huge. And I'm not giving anything you haven't seen away. This It's hard to give spoilers away on this. Uh, but he's Barry Pepper is playing her father who's unconscious in the basement. He's got this massive wound on him. It turns out there's a gator, this giant alligator in the basement and is now blocking their way to get out. So the entire movie, practically the entire movie, no, the entire movie, we are trapped in this house, in this basement and with a ticking time clock because the water is rising and uh, these gators are huge, you know, so and there's gators everywhere. There's gators outside, there's gators everywhere you can imagine. So a real simplistic plot, but what I understand is based on true events. You know, somebody got trapped in their basement during a hurricane. Uh, so it, essentially it's Jaws in a basement. <laughs> That's what this movie is. And I love movies like this you know, because they're just crazy fun. They really are very, and you want to say it's like a B movie, but the production values are pretty incredible. You know, it's got incredible atmosphere. You've got all the rain coming down. Remember that movie, Hard Rain with Morgan Freeman where, um, there, uh, these these guys robbing a uh, an armored truck uh, with uh, what's his name, Christian Slater, and uh, the the water's coming in and uh, to this town and it's flooding and they're they're trapped. They got all this money but they can't figure out how to get their money back. That's what the, this movie reminded me of because that was an incredible movie with hard rain where they they took a soundstage and flooded it. You know, so all the homes are up to like the second story. Well, same thing going on here. And what's really fun about this movie is the deaths. I, I count I think six deaths, five or six deaths in this movie. And when you, if you've watched Nat Geo, if you've seen what, well, those are crocodiles. These are alligators here in North America. But if you've seen what gators can do to people, you know, it's pretty horrific. You know, you don't die instantly. They take off limbs. They grab you. They spin, you know, and then if more than one gator's there, they start ripping you apart. I mean, get on YouTube and watch some of these real disturbing gator attacks, you know, on animals, like on zebras and stuff like that. It's really disturbing. So the movie has got incredible atmosphere with the rain coming down and with uh, the sense of, uh, of urgency. I mean, this is a wet... A uh, muddy, disgusting sensation. It really is. I mean, you're watching just they're crawling through the mud. Uh, they're they're when they're, every time they're injured, you're just like you're cringing every time someone gets bitten. And I have to mention one scene right away. It's in the trailer, so I don't care. But it's much more effective when you see it in the movie. Is that she has a gun at one point, and a gator grabs her up to her elbow, and she just unloads the clip while the gator's shaking her. I mean, this is the type of movie that everyone in the audience was cheering. It really was. And this is such a fun hour and twenty minute movie. Yeah, it's really short. So this movie gets in there fast, gets you, you know, out of your seat. And uh, also, if you have like a phobia about things underneath the water, like in Jaws, because you've got these gators and she's like trying to swim to get a boat. She's trying to swim to save her father. And these things are just these prehistoric monster dinosaur alligators are just terrorizing the whole time. It's so cool. Now, I know what you're saying, Jeff. Well, you know, here, Crawl, how about some alligator facts? Well, glad you asked. Did you know shark attacks kill six people a year? More than 1,000 die in crocodile and alligator attacks. Yeah, more people get killed by these thunder lizards. You know, alligators first appeared some 37 million years ago, making them officially living dinosaurs. Now, most of crawl takes place at night or as the sun's going down because alligators can see clearly at night and they're capable of eating 23% of their body weight at a time. That equals to 180 pound man eating 141 pounds of steak. And there's an estimated 5 million American alligators spread out across the southeastern United States, and roughly over a million alligators live in the state of Florida. And alligators are territorial. They will fight other alligators to defend their young. And finally, alligators are not picky. I mean, they will eat anything they can get their jaws on. And speaking of jaws, this movie also has a little dog in it named Sugar, and it's just such a throwback to Pippet yeah, from, from Jaws, you know? So you always have a, a dog in one of these, of these horror films, and you don't know if he's going to survive or not, but you're cheering for Sugar the whole time. So really great reactions from both actors. I love Barry Pepper and Kaya just she is just 
reacting to nothing there. You know, I, I just love this. This is such a great way to spend an hour and 20 minutes, bring a date, bring a friend, cheer on the alligators, cheer on Barry Pepper, just cheer them all on because it's just a great time. And this is from executive producer Sam Raimi. He hasn't made a movie in like 10 years, but he's executive producer. He so much wasn't creative control of this movie. Uh, the director, uh, Alexander Aja, I hope I'm saying your name right. Uh, he did, you know, Piranha 3D and he's uh, the, just really, really great eye. This director really knows how to create suspense and great mood and uh, also Sam Raimi giving his uh, expertise to distribution and getting financing for the film so this is a fun time guaranteed for all if you like that kind of thing I, it's very violent I mean I had to put my, my fingers on my eyes because when you see some of these gators cut people in half it's like it's pretty graphic all right for more reviews and interviews just surf on over to my website at vegasfilmcritic.com check me out on social media Facebook Twitter Instagram and if you're watching on YouTube which you should be Please make sure you subscribe, uh, thumbs up, and give me a comment below. What did you think of Crawl? Did you like it as much as I did? It was pretty cool. I'm Jeffrey K. Howard in Las Vegas. Thank you for joining me. I'll see you next time.